Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I remove um, a previous design and um, prep the natural now and stuff like that ready for a redesign. So here I'm using my Sayang K35 and I'm using this tapered tapered bit from um, Glitter Planet. Um, I'm new with well I've used this for about two weeks a week or two weeks something like that but I love it there's absolutely no like heat up at all well I've asked all my clients and they're like it's so nice so much better so I really do recommend this bit so yeah that's from glitter planet and you can use my code tracy10 if you want to purchase this and get a little bit of money off so as you can see I'm literally removing most of the design back down to that clear layer that we originally put down um, any bits I leave on because I do come in with a different bit just to like a more of a, a softer bit <laughs> um, just to go around her cuticle area and when we're close to the nail I forgot to mention um, that this is all done in real time. I think it was just over three minutes for one hand, which is pretty good, I think. Um, Lucy had this set on for as well for, I think it was three and a half weeks, um, and they're still perfect. So now I come in with this safety bit. I know when I originally got it, it was from eBay or Amazon. I think it was Amazon. So I have no link or anything like that because it was such a long time ago. It's mega, mega blunt, This, but this is why I love using it. Um, so here I'm just literally flattening out um, the bulk at the cuticle area and trying to make it as flush to her natural nail without touching it. Um, and just trying to remove all that acrylic as much as I can. And if I was to say, what well, one bit could you not live without, it would be definitely this bit, just because it helps with any lifting as well that may be on the nail. You just literally file on it and it will just ping straight off. You're not touching, not the natural nail, anything like that. So I, I love using this bit. So now I'm going to come in with my um, cuticle pushers and push back all her cuticles. And then I'm coming in with my cuticle bit, another one from Glitter Planet. Um, and I'm just going to whiz around and remove all that dead skin off her nail. So now I'm going to come in with my sanding band. I have about thousands, probably 
probably hundreds and thousands that's a lie probably about a thousand um sanding bands i got them in bulk in fine i only have the fine ones and i use a new one for every client um so i'm just gonna literally tickle her natural now with it and then if there's any acrylic um existing acrylic i'll just flatten that out with that no burning nothing i'm literally doing it with such a light hand so yeah once i've done that it's literally done i will come in and i'll just shape the sides gently but make sure that you're being extra careful because they are mega thin these are her natural nails obviously we've been doing a feel after feel after feel and um, so i think she's due for a probably a fresh set soon so yeah i just kind of i'm not too bothered about um getting the shape perfect because i'll do that with the acrylic at the end once i've applied it so i'll just try and make it a little bit neater just so it's easier to apply your acrylic um and then i'll dehydrate remove the dust obviously dehydrate and um, prime and then i go in my clear layer i didn't leave that in because i don't know why this video does end quite quickly <laughs> Um, so yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this video and it helped you a little bit. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, um, I'd love it if you did. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.